Hello everyone, this is Nat Life Sanabek and welcome back to Gun and, and Gendaichi Case Files. I'm gonna shortcut that because my tongue keeps forgetting. So yeah, now talk to that ass. We're gonna ask, why did you murder Sasayama-san? Not gonna talk? Is this true? <gasps> You're out! How long have you been listening? <laughs> Did you really kill him? Oh, no. You can't. Let me handle this. If I just silence him. Silence? You mean like what you did to Sasei Amazon? Ah! He's the one that deserves the blame. They're the bad ones. Trying to dig up unnecessary information. They? So I was right. Not only Sasei Amazon. But also the skeleton in the top diner. In addition to Sasayama-san, you also took away Miyase-san. I can't pronounce it. Miyase-san's life. What? For you, the silver bombing case was extremely convenient. There was an opportunity to get rid of evidence of Miyase-san's murder and the killing of Sasayama-san, who was investigating that. Is that true? Kuramoto. Did you really? I had no choice. I had to do it to protect the secret. The secret society of my ass. Secret. Could that be? The hit and run case of 25 years ago. Utaba Yu, who was a VIP at the time, died in a hit and run case. Doesn't that mean Mr. Kimoto was involved in that case? So he silenced the two people who were investigating it. It looks like Time of reckoning has come, has arrived at last. Owner! You look ugly! <laughs> Since the thing from the mine was stolen in the Futaba cases, being dug up, there is nothing to hide anymore. Our crimes on 25 years ago, and my cane that proved that I'm a vampire. <laughs> crimes on 25 years ago. I knew it. I knew nothing actually. <laughs> Just like Miyase san's script scribble note. So it was true. The VIB is on the island. Participating in the tragedy 25 years ago. Yeah, that's right. No! Oh no! Shut up! I'm tired of it. I'm tired of living in fear like Mayor Hyoki. He's still alive? What is the tragedy 25 years ago? What happened on this island 25 years ago? How does it relate to the thing that disappeared from the museum? The thing that disappeared from the museum. Right. It started there. Can we just get to it? Gold! Gold? It was Twilight Island's treasure. It helped this island develop. That gold suddenly disappeared. Oh well, I guess it can be helped. Him and Nicole. Stop it! It's unnecessary to say anymore! These bastards! If we take care of these bastards, SHUT UP! Stop it, Gurumoto! Hello. Yeah, start again my headphone again. Stop, stop, stop peeling on. What? Stop piling on your crimes. You're not the type of person to give up here. No, I won't let you! You're crazy. From all the killing. Hit, time to die! Hit force. Then. I'm going to use force too! With my shoes! Where did we get the football? Oh yeah, I forgot! I forgot you have an anywhere ball! Oh! I'm not up to date with the anime, so. I forgot that now. I forgot that he had a new thing that where you can just you can just make a ball appear out of nowhere. Ugh. From the belt, not anywhere. And uh, and hands kicking shoes. So like, eh. Kick the ball into my face. Oh my god, it's ugly. <laughs> Ow, oh god, hello. Lola went to work. Oh god, you're ugly. You're ugly. Ugh. Oh no, that's... Ugh. 
Who's standing here alive? Pretty strong for someone who said he had no physical strength. Exactly! Okay then. I need to hear the rest of the story from Kimoto-san. About the gold that disappeared from the folk museum. You are going to regret this! If you interfere any further, we're going to end up like those two. Sorry, but I have come to a point where I can't look back. I have to solve this island's mystery. To save my friends. ARE YOU KIDDING ME?! WHERE'S KAKORU?! That's beyond the smoke a person. Whoa! The kid exterminated the copycat. Thanks, kid. Kid, you're bored of a small. You're bored of small fireworks, right? I'm bored too. So I'm thinking of finishing the opening and moving on to the main event. What do you think? What the hell are you saying? Exactly! What are you doing? Tell everyone for me. To enjoy the taste of the tragedy again. Wait! Where's my boss? Is anyone gonna save us? Where's Kogoro? You're finally awake. Jeez, why? That's why I told you to wait here. You're just lucky that you didn't get injured in that explosion. But you were in there. Uncle. Huh? Oh yeah, where is he? Who's he? The real culprit of the silver bombing. I see. He showed up there. Ah, I forgot about you. <laughs> I heard the story from Professor Agasa just now. That Kuromoto Takeshi, he took Kimoto's secretary, and it's the imposter. With this explosion, the true culprit most likely tried to get rid of the imposter who copied his own acts. No! What? What? <laughs> I, <laughs> my daughter, <laughs> did us to die. <coughs> no. Received severe injuries, but he's still alive. However, he is not in the condition to talk. What about that one? No! That's my face right now. Time is ten. <coughs> He's not the only one who disappeared. <clears throat> what do you mean? What do you mean? Tell me everything! Come into the kitchen. This person is a VIP. Hino Hayato. What? Why? Why are they all disappearing? Oh man, I love your face. Okay. Hello. Are you okay? Are you still okay after meeting them? You're certainly no ordinary kid. <laughs> Stop! Shush. We have Mori. We. <laughs> We're chasing him. Shouldn't we discuss that right now? Yes. Swarmy face. We tell me. How about him? How about a choose here to me? Yeah, got it. Please don't <laughs> Mori is right there! I couldn't see his face because of the smoke, but he said, the tragedy again. Tragedy? Again? He's talking about the tragedy on the island 25 years ago. Looks like everything is tied to it after all. The case of Toba Misa, the cereal bombings, the cereals, and the milk. <laughs> Phrase 25 years ago? It's a tragedy again. Does that mean the series of incidents is still... Yeah. This case is still ongoing. Right. If what he said was true, the case isn't finished yet. The bomb! 
Oh god, the face! We bought a small fire, right? I'm bored too. You're crazy! You look like E.T. What do you think? <coughs> yeah, right. I'm never gonna let that happen. I'll never. Thus, the serial bombing case was tentatively put to an end. However, Himoto Yoji, the one who knew the truth, was engulfed by the smoke. Are we going to the next chapter? Remain shrouded in darkness. And the wee oui, wee. Oui. <laughs> oh no. And the real culprit who started the silver bombings. Even though he was in front of me, I couldn't do anything. Because I got knocked out. Yet the ominous, 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 ominous words that had left, only those words, continued to resonate in my ears. What do you think? I don't want it. I don't want it. And meanwhile, Kindaji's island had new disappearances and. Yeah, wait! Curtains had been risen at the same time. <laughs> Bam bam! Yes! S! I'm coming! Jeez! Back from toilet. No! <coughs> what is this supposed to be? You know, I'm glad that the. What? No, don't eat that. You have to eat rice. I'm glad now that this. The, 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 the mistakes that you do in a bomb does not include into the thing. The progress. Because I have D already every time. That's not my cake. That's everybody cake. Finally! Kindaichi! We're only on chapter 4! At the request of the former classmate, blah blah blah. blah. I don't want to read that summary. Blah blah blah. blah. Share with me. Blah blah blah. 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 Blah You've been mulling it around now. Have you come up with anything? <coughs> Nothing. He's ignoring you. What's happening with the blah blah? At the time, the man said, It's not just they. It's not just that they look alike. This is exactly Twilight Island. It's Twilight Island 25 years ago. That is what he said. But Ichinozuke, she said before he died. What could he have met? Hard to, say, hard to say for sure, but about about either. But I've solved numerous impossible cases in the past. Very impossible. And with those, there must be a logical explanation. This case will be no exception. I will definitely expose the truth. I bet that Misa was also expecting me to solve it. That's right. For myself and to fulfill Misa's wishes, I have to do it to solve the mysteries of this island. You idiot, <laughs> Uncle! I no longer just want to get back to Twilight Island. On the contrary, until this is all solved, I won't go back. Oh my eyes! <laughs> Alrighty, let's decide it. <clears throat> decide it? What do you mean? I have considered a lot of path, but this should be fast. The risk involved is drier, but I bet we could get something. What are you doing? What are you doing? In this case we've been involved in. It's a layer it has some layer buried in the tragedy to blah blah blah. What's more the tragedy from the past. It started to repeat itself on this island. But it can go to that person. The person. The one who claimed to be Toba Misa's mother. Toba Michuru. I'm squishing my fish. Bleh. She killed Ichinose Keiji and em uh, emulated the tragedy. As the culprit, she has to know something about it. About the tragedy 25 years old. We're gonna find her! Yoki locked her up in the factory. 
I don't think he's going to just let us waltz in in there, do you think? <coughs> he's not going to say a big fan of us. Unless you've thought of a way around that. I... Nope, you don't. Well, if we continue working in the dark, it'll get nowhere. Let's go to flow then. Time to find out. You are an idiot. <laughs> We're dead meat. The faster Yogi is sure in the factory. Toba Mitsuru should also be a prince of there. And Daiji, let's go. Yeah, let's do that. We're dead. We are dead. Toba Mitsuru is imprisoned in the factory. Again with your toys! <clears throat> Probably in the stars. My nose. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Where you were held before. <clears throat> that storehouse? Oh god, that small room. We need to go to the courtyard. But we can't get to church, there was no one there. What do we do? Don't you quiet. Machines were allowed before. They know you're here. Oh, God. We can no longer hear machines rushing. Wait, maybe. Uncle? It might be luck. No, they're not off. They're there. Good luck. Why? It's unnaturally quiet. And no smoke is coming out from the stacks. Just maybe. <coughs> Rest day. And that's it. Uncle, let's hurry. Let's head to the storehouse. You idiots. They're there. They're there. Hurry. We are so dead. We're dead. I told you we're dead. Turns out it was just you guys. What the hell brought you here? Toba Mitsuru-san, we have things to ask you. Will you speak with us? <clears throat> Don't tell me no! Repeated the crime from the tragedy 25 years ago. So you should know exactly what the 25 years ago tragedy is! We'd like you to tell us about it. I'm trying to find it. Damn, again! Not again. Hello, okay. No idea what that is. Oh, you sneaky. That can't be. You haven't told us your reason for killing Ichinose Keiichi. Tell us. Why did you have to kill him? What could it be? I don't remember. Why are you so weird, woman? Another toilet add in to the one we started on. There's too much we don't know about this place. So please tell us about this island and its secrets. There are no secrets. This island, Twilight Island, is, as you can see, a poor coal mining island. That's it. You are a witch, I swear! Not again. You really don't know a girl named Toba Misa. You have the same surname, and your first names, and your first name is linked to her. And your appearance is also the same. And you're saying you don't know her. Toba Misa. It's true her name is similar to mine, but I know no one by that name. Enough. Why? <laughs> you finally get it. It's a pity, you took all this time to come here too. Cut the crap. It's because of her. All because of her. Uncle? How can I come down? Do you understand? That's Misa's murder. The woman is partially responsible for it. 
Her murder? Yeah, that's right. The girl you feign not knowing, Toba Misa. She was involved in a tragedy linked to the, ki the case on Twilight Island and was killed. You are an accomplice for fearing ignorance and stayed silent. You bear some responsibility for the murder of Toba Misa. Although, that's enough for now. It's okay. Kinashi. We're leaving now, but what about you? Are you coming out with us? I would rather stay here than leave with your help. Hi, Pride! Shinyo, please cooperate then. Where are the kids? We came all this way and did nothing. No, it may not be in total loss. Hey, did you really find something? No, not something, but don't you think it's strange? Toba Misa's reaction just then. When you mentioned Toba Misa's death, her demeanor changed completely. As he thought, she really must know, must have known Misa. At the time, her mouth hung open. As if she couldn't believe. Even so, she still does, isn't cooperating with us. So, what should you do? Alas, we must wait till she leaves. A woman's heart isn't so fickle. You idiot! <laughs> Jeez, so carefree. Exactly! Now let's look for the kids. No worries, Uncle. Good things are hard, hard to be. Huh? Good things are to be ate. I think you mean good things come to those who. <laughs> That's stupid! <coughs> I'm stuck! Just stick it out to the bitter end. Wait, they're gonna go wait for their 25 years later? Now what? Where do we go? Well then, let's get going. Let's get stupid. <laughs> Anywhere's fine with me. We don't have enough information yet. After all, one has feet to get to the truth. If you get stuck, use your feet. It's a golden rule of policing. As such, let's investigate this island one more time. Until we find a clue, I won't give up it. Yeah, we'll find three kids in the middle of nowhere! <coughs> we need to put an international on the island. and a little matches. Okay. Mm. I didn't want to click that. seen a kid here. So what you doing here? I'm being chased. Eh? By someone. E. Chasing you. Someone is trying to arrest me. Huh? Can you give us the details? What? Who's after you? 
Oh, you're being chased. I don't know. <coughs> Are you really being chased? Yes. You're weird! Even for my standards, it's a bit weird. Your mother isn't with you? I don't know. What? Uh, how about your name, kid? Oh, come on! You don't know your name? What is this? <clears throat> I don't know again. <gasps> what with this kid? <coughs> I was here. Hey, this girl's clearly behaving weird. Doesn't know her name or her mother. Amnesia? And amnesic? Oh, great. Amnesic! This child! What are we supposed to do? Kindaichi! Don't ask me, I'm not good with kids. You do something, uncle. You're the police inspector here. Shush, man! But I'm not a dad. A police? Man? Yes, oh, so smart looking already, immediately. <laughs> My name is Kimochi Samu. And this weird guy is Kendaichi Kajimi. Oh, great, again. You may not look like it. Again with this sentence! <laughs> you won't know him, but he's the grandson of the Kendaichi Kajimi. Many faces. Faces. Oh, God. Eee! <clears throat> eee! My head! Oh god. Eee! Stop! Don't come! Stop! What the hell? Hey, hey, hey! What's wrong? Hey! Don't faint! Please don't pass out. I'm okay. Now. Uh, uncle? Shouldn't we take this? <laughs> You're not gonna talk about the idiot like this. <coughs> I think so. Wait! Wait a minute! Are you really a policeman? And a detective? You solve cases? Um, yeah we do. Why? <coughs> you saw mysteries? Yes! I know it. Police inspector's detective. They're very smart. Um... What? It's so. What? Believe you. What? I can solve the charge riddle. So, what's the riddle, little one? <clears throat> what's the top die? What's the top die without the snake's eye? What? Where did a little girl hear such a thing? I'm lost. <laughs> she thinks so too. So the problem was, what's the top die without the snake's eye? <coughs> I don't have a die. I never even look at a die properly, so I don't know. Talk the top die. And then we'll probably the snake's eye. What? <laughs> oh, sorry. Fingernail. Ah! Yuck! Okay, I have to start <coughs> looking at the internet because I didn't know what's it. I didn't know the image of a die. <coughs> so, and then I thought, okay, that's not right. <laughs> <coughs> you have to think properly. It's a mathematical equation. And because of that mathematical equation, I kind of stopped my recording. <laughs> Stupid me. Wait, let me check my recording if it's still there. <laughs> so I have about 30 more minutes. Record. Okay. 
What's the top die without the snake's eye? <coughs> In one die, there's six numbers. So the top die is the largest number, which is six. The snake's eye, because if you put two dice together, snake's eyes means one on one, uh, one from each die. And you do one eye, snake's eye means one. What's the top die? Six without the snake's eye. Minus one is five. What's mine? What's mine? There you go. Mother, what's my eye? One also? Yeah, I already know the secret to the riddle. First, you have to recognize that die reverse the dice. The numbers on the die roll from 1 to 6. So 6 is our top die. Can you go back there? Okay. If we then take away 1 or the snake eye, snake's eye, as it's known, we get the answer 5. Well, am I right, kiddo? <clears throat> Incredible! You really solved it. <coughs> you believe us now? Uh, no, only this guy, not the police. <coughs> it was a tough problem, but an easy one for me, Mr. Detective. Easy. This riddle? Hmm? What about it? Mom taught me it, but but I I can't remember. I can't remember Mom's face. Oh god. I can't remember. Mama says, Are you Misa? <coughs> Are you Toba Misa? No. Yep, as you said, this old timer is a police inspector. There's nothing a police inspector can't find. Only solve he can't have, he has a problem. <coughs> hey, Kinaji, don't speak for me. Think about the situation, Red. You don't have time to meddle in other people's affairs. Then you just want to leave this hid here? Now! That's... Stop it, you heartless bastard! Let's investigate this island, right? It might be easier to research with this child with us. Who's the other three? Probably a child from this island. Now that you mention it, that could be true. Got it. As you said before, till the bitter end. As expected from Uncle. <coughs> oh god, that's a bad cough. Is good for you too? Sorry. No, it's not a time to apologize. So... Don't think I got through that. <laughs> <laughs> God damn it! It's chasing me. That's all I can remember. Apart from that, I I don't know. Uh, anything that was like this island. <clears throat> um. I did, but <coughs> <coughs> oh god! But I was just asking her too. So you wouldn't happen to know where the hospital is? <coughs> Let me see. No, not again. <coughs> what happened? Are you okay? What do you remember? <clears throat> A case? A case? A suitcase? Someone died. What? D? What? Someone chasing. Fire trucks. Oh, you saw murder. That's why they're chasing. Oh, God. You faded! <coughs> Uncle! <coughs> you crazy!
crazy! Oh god! <coughs> oh, the am amnesia girl who fainted in the what? Now, having to make the chance of this island, but well, it was really by chance. No, rather, <coughs> we're dead. <coughs> I need the water. Hold on. No, I don't want to look at your belly. Look, oh, how's the girl? Hi, belly button. I'll eat it. <laughs> sleeping in the room next door. Her face is like every other kid sleeping. Despite everything. I also asked the old lady here about the hospital. She said this island's clinic was closed down and no doctors remain. <gasps> Gosh. What kind of place is that? A hellhole! The child was quivering. She must have been scared. Scared out of her wits. Yes, you're right. You saw it too, Uncle. What is this? Something in her appearance. <coughs> chocolate? No. <coughs> Your Lola said no chocolate now. Yes. Chocolate now, but don't eat chocolate. What she was about to remember. She wins. Her face wins in pain. <coughs> Heard from a doctor that it's a... Psycho Nick. Get your hands out of your pocket. It's a psycho Ned. Psychogenic loss of memory. It's memory loss caused by intense stress and trauma. Shock. It's more of a shock. Set off by the brain to maintain stability. But it kinda hurts, doesn't it? Losses. <coughs> the key is likely in the fearful experience she experienced. Fearful experience. That should be. Died. Oh, it's when somebody died in front of her. I'm seeing someone die. She also said she was chased by someone. Wait, perhaps this kid was being chased by someone who's the murderer! Witness what she described as a case? So she witnessed some case. Seems we got tangled up in some trouble again. Oh god. Oh god, am I burping? This is not good. It's not ladylike. Well, I'm never, I never was ladylike. So shush. <coughs> Seems like it. From one trouble to another, we keep getting out. What the hell's with this island? Why are you asking me that? <coughs> On this another Twilight Island. Wandering on. This mysterious girl we met told us someone died. <clears throat> I can only get an ominous feeling from these words. From those words, from that words. <coughs> that was short. Live. The next morning. Is the girl around? Oh no! Wake up, good night, you. Is she gone? <coughs> Wake the hell up! What the heck? Ah! <laughs> what is it? That's the worst way to wake up. No time to relax. Something is gone. She's gone. What is it? She's gone, isn't it? What is it, Uncle? Why are you so panicked? She's not here. You mean? No, tell me the kid. Yeah, I do. When I woke up, she was already. Was gone. Or dead. That kid. She's already gone when I woke up. Her food on is neatly folded too. While we were sleeping, she seems so. She left despite being chased and having lost her memory. Oh. God. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Everybody, everybody line up, line up, line up, line up. You two are white, really. 
You may have seen the kid. Where's the kid? Good morning, Granny. Ah, good morning. Peenies are very important, right? Every day started to green. Peenies are what? Shush! Okay, shush! Jeez! I regret doing that. <clears throat> Miss, I'd like to ask you something. Did you see a little girl come out of your room? You have a child? But you're so young. Not me! No, 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 no! No? So... Is it possible that you kidnap Ah! No, 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 no! A lot of things happened to that kid. She's, uh... The child of a friend. I was entrusted to take care for her. Friend's child. That was all, huh? So, what's your answer? Did you see her or not? Yeah, I saw her. She was a somber, somber child, kid. Even though I greeted her good morning, she ignored me. She was walking as if she's still sleeping, her eyes empty. Oh no. Oh, uh, Granny! Sorry, but we're in a hurry. Where did that kid go? Now listen to all your sermon sermons. <laughs> 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 Yes, yes, yes. Got it. That kid went somewhere with some strange guys. No! Not again! <clears throat> they all left together. No! I have a bad feeling. Let's go find her. What now? Not that. It's about the kid. She's dangerous. What? Who's calling her dangerous is... I'm not talking about greetings. It's just I have a bad feeling. That she's going to bring disaster upon you. I'm just feeling like that. Sure sounds ominous to me. <clears throat> I had that ominous feeling. It's no joking matter. That kid is in danger. I have to save her. Nevermind, we have already invited disasters upon ourselves. We're not afraid. Right, Uncle? <clears throat> yep. Exactly. I see. If so, do as you please. But I have warned you. Grandma! Anyway, let's hurry. Kendashi, I'm worried for her safety. Oh, God. Where did she go? I'm thinking shrine because that's usually the first place you go to. <coughs> For the first time, it seems she's not here. Here. Wait, Uncle. What, 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 what? It's weird. Hasn't it changed? What changed? No, wait. As I thought, this place. It gives me a bad feeling. Good night, G. What are you talking about? <clears throat> What well, is this bad feeling you're talking about? Is it related to the girl being taken by these guys? I don't know, but it's an incredibly bad feeling. Often turns out to be true! Now that you mention it, I sense it too. Can we please? What? There were no tire tracks. <clears throat> the back alley. Think of tire tracks. Oh god. <clears throat> the girl saw someone died at this place with tire tracks. Oh no. Oh no. There's surely something. They're dead! They're go she's gonna get killed in the alley! <clears throat> you stop shaking that bank. Tire tracks left on the residential street. Following that trail, 
Everything changed the second we started that Oh god. Shocking scene emerged to meet our eyes. Not again! Why, 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 why? 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 Then there was... Someone died. Oh, buddy. With Georgie, it seems your bad feeling was right. It's bad. <clears throat> what a turn of events. Did it crash through the fence? What the hell is happening on this island? Oh, well, first, let's investigate the uh, crime scene. We'll talk afterwards. But shouldn't we check our surroundings first? No, I want the thing! I'll still keep doing it. There's new shoes on mine. We'll get dirty too. Shut up about your shoes! Shoes are meant to get dirty. Hmm? Wait. Shoes getting dirty. Yeah, his shoes are too clean. Look! Oh, yeah. This is a car side view mirror. Given that the scene is also sort of a clue. Let's keep it for a moment. Why would you keep it? Why would you keep a car side mirror? Your shoes are too clean. I'm pointing at the pants. Something isn't right. <clears throat> it's his shoes. His shoes are odd. His shoes. What is it, Uncle? Are Italian? His luxurious shoes. Why did your mind jump to that? That's not what I meant. The odd point is that his shoes is too clean. The soles are too clean. Rather walking here would get muddy all over their shoes. No matter what, it's strange for the shoes to get clean. Can we just take the shoes? <coughs> <coughs> the victim's fingers. Marking on his left hand and the third finger. I can't see anything. The victim's shirt cuff. Some shiny things are stuck to it. You mean the cuff on the collar? Just some small things. The window? <clears throat> Glass shards. Wait, wait, I want to see your cuffs. I usually like. I I love. Ha I love those cuffs. <coughs> oh. Those cuffs. C U F F. The sleeve cuffs. I really like those. I like the designs on the cuffs. I know I don't wear them because it's normally for men. But I love the designs on the cuffs. I own some of them. I own some of I own some of the cuffs because it belonged to my grandfather, and my grandfather usually don't wear the cuffs unless he has a um, unless somebody requests his performance, uh, requests for his violin performance in a hotel in an event like that. <clears throat> And uh, when he died, I got the cuffs. I got the cuffs and I got his picture, I think. I didn't get many things. We weren't even allowed to see our grandfather's things. So, but I was luckily, luckily, lucky to be able to even get the cuffs and the picture before I was not allowed to touch anything else. I don't know why. Tire impressions on the ground are evident. Watch your step. The ground here is really muddy. Don't leave any untaminating footprints on the crime scene. Still wet. But it wasn't even raining. Long wind brings in a lot of spray from the sea. Oh, okay. Muddy foot ground. This is the safety fence. But it broke. Looks like it was destroyed by the high winds. A strong gust must have blown something that took it up. It's the car! When you wanna slip, the water's deep. We can't see the bottom at all. And this fence is interesting. Let's investigate a little more. The mesh of the fence is strange. It's cut on purpose! No, not that. It was neatly cut, like a sharp tool. Nothing stuck on it? Is that weird? Yeah. 
here by something and broke. <clears throat> Should have been left behind. It's too clean! There's a little leave on the other side of the fence. And it's a small leaf. Such a leaf could easily overflow. If you take the time to build leaf, it should be sizable. Weeds growing by the leaf. <coughs> they're healthy and in full bloom, but they're not crushed! Weeds are te tenacious. Weeds have spirit. That's the so what about it? Nothing. Just pique my curiosity. But they're not crushed! They weren't crushed! What's going on? And the, 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 the identity? Let me be here. Nope, it seems there's nothing identifying here. Eight. That's the case. Uh, cause of death. <clears throat> Victim suffered blows all over his body. Oh god. He's beaten quite severely. Probably died from it. For the time being, we're done investigating. Well, to get anything. I was uncovering all. I was uncovered. I uncovered a lot. I was uncovered a lot. Let me hear everything you've noticed. Start with the cause of death. Hmm. I think he was hit by the car. Was. He was hit by a car, right? Eh? Even I understood that. <laughs> the car truck. <coughs> The tire tracks left at the crime scene. That's the car size mirror. Just these facts, I understood it right away. Furthermore, he had blows to much of the body. Judging from all this, we conclude that the victim was hit by a car. There's not a much of the Bleh. Almost hit and run accident. God damn it. Okay. The car that entered this alley hit the victim. And due to it, the momentum must have gone into the sea. It broke the fence and went over the leaf. Probably a drunk driver. No! The victim in the car, what they can see, it may be hard to investigate further. The water here seems quite deep. There's no way we can lift up a car from the sea. No! The car did not fall in! No, 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 not that. Uncle, in your deductions, there's a serious mistake. Exactly! A serious mistake? Where? Hey, don't be jealous just because I out with you this time. No! I'm not a kid. I'm too old to really act like that. <laughs> Kid. So the mistake in my directions was I'm going to reveal it now. Was that a mistake? Was this is the moment. No. Must have gone. Yeah, he didn't. Nothing went in the water. Damn. Look, it stopped. That's what you deduce. But that's an obvious mistake. You're saying the car didn't go over. Yes. There are two pieces of evidence. Evidence that is proving it. The first is this safety fence. There's clearly something strange about it. The strange part is. How it was broken. Because it's too neat of a cut. What's wrong with the way it was cut? Or broken? If this fence was broken due to something, some traces of it should be apparent, no? Like if it's supposed to be broken by a car, some paint from the car should be left there. What's more, the fence is out cut out quite neatly. And it's it's as if <clears throat> A neat section was removed with a sharp tool. 
Sharp tool. What kind? Cutter? But we can be sure though that this fence was not broken by a car. The missing section was cut via a sharp uh, means. Now that you mention it, you may be right. <clears throat> and that's not all. There's still more evidence. The other thing proving the car didn't fall into the sea is... Um, um, that weird thing. Where is it? No, no, no. Uh, leave. It's not crushed. Uh, the car didn't have fallen into the sea is the leave. You're saying this leave is the whole sole reason, but this leave isn't big at all. You should be able to easily get over it. As you said, uncle, such a leave could easily be transferred by a car. And my shirt is going up for some reason. That's why there's something unnatural about this leaf. The leaf unnaturally pointed is the leaf's unnatural point is the weeds. It's not crushed. <clears throat> the weeds. See? Some weeds are going between the leaf and the ground, right? Think about it. True weeds are prominent there, but what about it? Are you listening? I want to ask, why are all the weeds still in full bloom? Why will, as I said, weeds have spirit? Uncle, that's not it. If the car had pierced the fence and went over the leaf, why s there's no sign of it there? Oh, I see. Yes, dumb face. You're finally realizing it, Uncle. That's it. If the car had really fallen into the sea, you wouldn't have it go over the leaf. Yet there's no traces of the car going over those weeds. Ah, my tongue is tied and I can't read properly. Do you not understand? What that means? The car didn't actually go over the leaf. Exactly. And it didn't fall. Didn't fall in the sea. I see. That's what happened. If the car didn't fall into the sea, then what happened? The car went forward and back and then go out. If the car didn't fall into the sea, it highly likely that this crime was faked by someone. To make it seem like the key evidence the car had been lost at sea. The remote section of the fence is also part of the fabrication. In other words, this case is not a simple hit and run. Yep. <laughs> Given that so much effort was put into faking the scene, we can't call it a simple accident. The likelihood of a planned murder is quite high. A murder case. The music is dying again. The one who lost her memory. Case. Tire tracks. There. Someone died. Don't tell me the case. Yep. It's she saw here. Again, another murder case on this side. Another murder with on another murder island. Hyoki Ryue. That guy did it. Hey! It has to be him! No doubt I'm designing something! No, that's not certain yet. But I'm going to make him confess or so! Oh, you idiot. Uncle! Nah. Kid who lost her memory is targeted after witnessing it. To know what we're investigating the case, such a culprit won't hesitate to aim for the kid's life next. To avoid that, no matter what. Let's run! You crazy uncle! Come back! Am I dead? You came too. Good, yeah, I made it in time. What are you talking about? Yes, Uncle, come down. If Yogi learns about the case now, the kid will be in danger. And does she look over there? What? Hey. Huh? I didn't expect her here too. Give me the perfect time. Change bands before you okay, let's get the kid to safety. What? 
What? Wait, what? Hey, kid, what are you doing? <laughs> Inspector son. You worried? Uh, yeah, kid, you know. It's dangerous for you to wander around this island. Especially since you're being chased by someone. A burden. That's what you think. Huh? Let's think of a bird. Oh no. Sorry. You're not a burden. Oh no. What in the world, you idiots? I'll let you get away again. What the hell are you saying? Let me go. I'll let you go never. What? What? Jeez, what are you doing? First of all, let him go. Never. I mustn't release him before the police arrive. The police is already here. I'm an inspector. Eh? He's arrested. Oh! I'm going to kill these kids one day or another. <laughs> Arrest! <coughs> Fine, but let's hear the details first. I'll arrest him afterwards. <laughs> See if you have no other choice but to believe him for now. That's right. First of all, let him go. Got it. Cow. How? I had a terrible time. These kids, I won't forgive them. This is bad. The culprit with the way again. Culprit. Me? Hey guys, what are you? I understand your anger, but an adult reaction would help here. An adult reaction. Yes, yes, let's first listen to their story. Fine, got it. I gotta get the curve. Need brats, let me tell you! Can I cheat? Add a reaction, please. Grrr, fine! Let's see, I'm done. Okay. There's your shumai on the table. Calling me the culprit, but what did I do? It's a culprit. Culprit, what the heck, you kids? Who are you? Your names. Please, even when you're the culprit. Ah! <laughs> even I would get annoyed. Kindaichi? I know, I know. Turn for management. Turn for management. Say, would you mind giving me your names? Okay, please. I have no choice. This is all I said to tell you. Thank you. I'm Toji Magenta. I'm Yoshida Ayumi. I'm... To... I never get to... I can never pronounce this one. I can only say Michiko. I cannot pronounce the other one. Never. Where did they take the boys? Hey! What's wrong, Kadachi? It's Bratz. Huh? And what about it? Uncle, we should know that name! It's already on that thing. The thing on the detective badge. <coughs> Did you remember what was written on the badge? Take the boys. Undoubtedly, some detectives obsess kids! I obtained on the Twilight Island. The guys met on the. Blah, 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 blah. These kids are. Must be from the Twilight Island too. And I've ended up on another Twilight Island. What is another Twilight Island? It's this island. This island is also another Twilight Island. Eh! You're saying this is island also Twilight Island? What are you saying? I don't get it. <clears throat> yeah, well, I don't get it either. And the thing that this detective badge is theirs. What a coincidence. I'm carrying what's formerly these brats. You know that guy who also has one. No one has been calling with. 
for dead. <coughs> I like that system. But first, take a look at this. Ah! Isn't that a detective badge? As I thought, it's yours. It seems this one is broken and can't be used anymore. I'd like to know about the guy I've been talking to with these. He's not a brat. More like my age on Twilight Island. Nope, nobody like that there. The only ones with the badges are us and the professor. And the professor isn't very young. Maybe you are mistaken? Oh god. There's no reason asking these brats again. I'll find out who is something. Hey? What is it? It's mine! It was left on the ferry. I kept it in the meantime. You must have come to Twilight Island on the same ferry as us. We were on the same ferry as the culprit? As I said, I'm no culprit. Stop calling me that! Instead, I go by Kindaichi Hejime. Look at my face. This isn't the face of that guy, is it? Now you're not a culprit. That's the last part. Uncle? <laughs> the most villainous face. <laughs> Hajime. You're the Gendaiji who mysteriously disappeared. Hmm? This guy to know me? And this inspector, he must be Inspector Kimochi. Yes, yeah, nice to meet you. So hey, if the two disappeared are here. That's right. It seems you've disappeared too, huh? We've disappeared! It got me! And after we snuck into that place and lost consciousness, Mr. Z disappeared and ended up here. I want to go home. Great. We're dead. These kids. Hey, hey, hey. Don't cry. Don't cry. Don't cry. Not we know. I'll shall be well. You and Kunaiji here will find your way back. <laughs> Didn't you also disappear? Can we really trust you to get us out? This guy is the culprit. Can we cut out? I can rely on you. Jeez, find a way by yourselves in that case. Actually, you should also be ashamed. I guess he's a... Why do we mysteriously disappear? Maybe it's the curse of that treasure? It disappeared. What treasure? Don't eat that. What's this treasure you're testing about? Ah, no, we will never. Hmm. And that you first try to find out what you did. Don't know why you're the culprit, then you'll get nowhere. Where am I the culprit? You are the culprit. Like I said, give me the reason. Stop it! This is not an adult! This is an idiot face! Go away her life. To them in your own words that I'm not the culprit. Wait, that is not true. Not true. The person chasing me is not him. They helped me. Eh, then. You finally get it. As I said, I'm no culprit. If that's it, why didn't you. We were trying to tell you, idiot! Uh, oh my gosh! Oh, they're hearing that she's been chased. This took me for the corporate since I was looking for her. Jeez! I am going Daddy. to go crazy! Crazy! <sighs> yes. Noisy! I don't give a damn. 
Are you finished with that coin? Did you put it back in the fridge? I think you ate it. No. You think, you think she's being chased after witnessing a crime. If that's true, the person chasing her is... Chocolate. The culprit of the earlier hit and run case. That's your culprit. You're chasing the tire tracks hit she's giving us. Don't pull. Now you have to throw. Yeah. I wanted to use that to fold, not to break. Hiya. I'm afraid of Ipis. No, there's no Ipis. Yeah. No, because he crimes it. She say Ipis as in cockroach, but they haven't seen any cockroach in this house. Because we have loads of cockroaches in the old house before. I don't know why. But I did. I, I think I know why. It's because of being in the island with grass and cows. Grass and cows? And buffalo. With no cow in Yakdong, only in my old house. Yes. We came across the crime scene. Now, go there. Boo. Boo. Bye. Boo. It's the same incident Boo. that she witnessed. Boo. 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 Keep her quiet since she saw. Boo. That's right. Boo. She witnessed. Boo. Where are the guys? But I have to say this episode because I'm already over budget, over time, over budget. So yeah, and I need to calm down my cough. It's getting worse. I cannot breathe anymore. <coughs> so yeah, thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed and want to see the next part of the of the Conan and Kendaichi case. And Ow. bye bye but. Uh -huh. Just simply wave your wand like a sorcerer and hit the like button and subscribe button to watch the next part. Stay away from my mic. Until then, this is Nightmare. Signing off!